Hi, it's Kristen Beadle from CPA Australia here to provide you with the June 2023 public practice update. Over the last month, more of the complimentary member only Australian tax time resources have become available on the CPA Australia website. Additionally, this year, a tax hub has been built on the website, which houses all of our Australian resources for tax time, including webinars, podcasts, and of course, the template letters. Throughout June, the remaining checklist will become available on the website. I also remind you to register your attendance for the year-end tax time update and resource roundup webinar being held on 18 July. For members in New Zealand, we now have available to view on the website the recording of the tax time webinar held on 6 April. It is coming to that time of year where clients may be sending you documents electronically. This is where you should be considering any cyber risks and ensure that attachments or links are from a trustworthy source. If you are unsure of your risks, CPA Australia has many resources available for you to consider in your cybersecurity suite. Please visit the Cybersecurity Hub on our website to access these resources. If you wish to stay up to date on the latest cyber alerts, you can subscribe to Alerts in Australia from the Australian Cyber Security Centre or in New Zealand, read the latest alerts from the National Cyber Security Centre. We are aware of the significant uptick in requests by lenders of our members to provide capacity to repay letters. CPA Australia has released updated guidance to assist you to navigate these requests and also release template letters for members to use if they consider it appropriate to undertake the engagement after considering the guidance. CPA Australia is delighted to launch a suite of resources to help you service your clients who may have a farming business. This suite of resources includes podcasts, e-learning modules and videos. Keep an eye out for the new resources in this area, including e-learning on carbon accounting for farming clients to be released shortly. With lingering inflationary pressure and increases in interest rates, our members are telling us that their clients' businesses are facing increased financial pressure. It is critical that you understand the signs of distress to enable you to advise your clients appropriately. To that end, CPA Australia has released a new e-learning module as part of the My Firm, My Future suite of resources called Responding to Indicators of Financial Distress. If you or your staff are thinking of obtaining a public practice certificate, we are holding face-to-face -face workshops in Melbourne on 12 to 13 July or Sydney on 12 to 13 September. These sessions are facilitated by experienced public practitioners who will help guide you on the next steps in your career in public practice. If you can't make these face-to-face -face sessions, CPA Australia also holds monthly virtual classes. Thank you and I look forward to seeing you next time.